G'day guys, Aaron here from Pacific Toyota Used Cars. Just wanted to take you through a little virtual tour on our 2021 Ram Warlock. Now we're away uh, for a couple of days over the Chrissy break, so I thought I'd get a uh, little video done for you anyway and uh, get it straight through to you. So look, we're gonna start down the front. Uh, I'm gonna go throughout the Ram inside and out, showing any little features um, and, and the vehicle, and then also any little scratch marks or little um, you know, marks or blemishes like that as well. So we like to be as transparent as possible. So I'll start up the front. Um, as you can see, massive front grill there. Um, got your two toe points down the, down the bottom there as well. All your fog lights and sensor lights and everything like that there. Um, all your, your massive size of headlights here with all your indicators, high beams and everything in there as well. As you can see, your bonnet, massive big bonnet scoop, heaps of airflow um, side of things that go over there to allow the, uh, the big engine to, to get going. So have a look down the side here. Nice big alloy rims there as well. Plenty of tread on the tyres there. Um, as you can see down the side here, really, really nice. I'll see your 5.7 litre Hemi engine in there as well. Up on the windscreen, no chips, cracks, dings or anything like that. We'll come around the other side here as well. Have a bit of a look down the guard, tyre and rim there as well. Plenty of tread on the tyres. Alrighty, show you up on the roof as well. Do apologize about a bit of the rain. It's uh, not the best weather today. That's our yard just over there as well. So um, look, I, I am in the service department at the moment just because it's a bit of cover. Um, but as you can see, you've got the Rhino platform up the top here, front rack um, with your backbone system. So really, really nice. Um, nice and low profile as well on the, on the top of there, but good for any bits of storage that won't fit in the car. Have a look down the side and the doors and that, really, really nice and clean. The, the truck's immaculate, so no dings or anything like that. I would see your full factory side steps down the bottom as well. And around to the tub, so as you can see on the tub, really nice all the way around as well. Rim and tire down there too. Now you do have your ram boxes in either side as well, so nice little feature in the tub, but um, as you can see, fair bit of storage down either side there. Chuck a couple of bags of ice in there even. Make sure that's closed. Come around the back, so obviously you've got your uh, tow bar under there as well. You've got some Anderson plugs there and some tow plugs there as well, so already all set up for that side of things. Got your rear sensors around the rear bar there. You've got a, a rear light as well. Nice massive tailgate. Put that down as well so let's have a look in here we've got our um we've got a a fridge slide set up in here too so as you can see there fridge slide comes all the way out got a full setup here with arb compressors you've got some uh anderson plug outlets here as well as some 12 volt sockets there too so you've got all power in the back here um you've got a compressor switch there compressors mounted just back behind and then uh, that's just a flick to switch to go on. So obviously ignition on and that side of things. Um, but that's all already set up. So really, really nice and handy. Great little setup. Now this does um, come back off with a couple of your clips here. So clips come down and then your uh, back folds up there all the way around. So really, really nice. Plenty of storage and you know, ways to get in and out of the, the truck too. So, other Ram box on the other side as well. Really, really nice. As you can see, super, super clean um, all throughout there as well. Alrighty, I'll uh, just whack the tailgate up so you can see the reverse camera inside, but um, I'll jump inside and uh, go through the interior got the two keys as well and then you've got the two obviously spare ones um, but we'll jump in the back first and have a bit of a bit of a look so as you can see down our doors really really nice and clean full carpet floor mats all throughout so much room in here as well a little bit of storage up under there um, under the 
the bottom of the seats there either side. So really, really nice all throughout here. Heaps and heaps of room. Got your air compressor hose there as well. And then a couple of Rhino Rack um, tie down platforms there for the roof as well. So super clean. Um, as you can see, it's been really, really well looked after and there's so much room in these rooms. Alrighty, we'll have a look in the driver's side, um, full interior. So all your window locks, door locks, everything like that all down the side here. As you come inside here, all your light switches are just here. Got your handbrake side things here. So it's your foot brake and then your release there as well. So that's the handbrake. Um, all carpet floor mats in there, genuine as well. Obviously all leather seats inside all throughout. I will jump on in. And um, so I got the keys just in the center wherever, it can be in your bag or anything like that. Uh, Fall on the brake and then just the engine start stop there. Um, all right, so as you can see, uh, just there we've got 19,000 Ks. So all good there, no engine lights, warning lights, anything like that. Um, obviously all the gauges work, you've got your lights set up and everything there as well. Uh, all our options here to scroll through the interior and uh, go through the full setup of the screen. And uh, that one here is to do your screen display as well. So you can change around the displays um, pretty easily. So plenty of options uh, for that side of things. This one here, your cruise control settings, and then there's a gear, um, so a selection of gears. So you can be a manual mode if you want, but that's uh, lower and higher gears as well to go up and down. So that's your gear selector if you wanted to get in a manual mode. Uh, in the middle here, so we've got all our touchscreen display. Now we go to just our normal media. My phone's actually connected to this as well. So um, that's, that's what will show up there. But you know, you've got your media, you've got your full map display set up as well there anyway. Um, if you wanted to dial into any radios, that side of things, you can go to your apps, apps and that as well. Heaps and heaps of options um, throughout this there as well. So all your climate controllers in here as well. So you've got all your aircon controls you can do on the screen and down here. So there's heaps and heaps of different ways to go about it all. Um, in in the in the settings here, so plenty of uh, plenty of things to muck around with. Um, I'll put it in reverse, so that gearing is just the the twist knob there. Um, so obviously drive um, and reverse there. So there's your reverse camera. When you turn the steering wheel, um, it does move as well. With you to show you where you're going, as you can see there. Uh, now let's have a look here. I'll just put the lights on so you can see the the interior here So all your aircon controls as well. Everything's all there. You got your tow and haul mode there um, You've got heaps and heaps of controls down here We're in two-wheel drive at the moment, but obviously you got your four-wheel drive low and your four-wheel drive diff locks there as well All your volume settings as well just here um, As well as your tune on this side as well We'll head over the left-hand side here. So oh, we'll have a look through the middle um, massive bit of storage here. This one here just goes in the back, so that's just got to get put in underneath there. But um, look, obviously you've got all your USB points and everything in here as well. Heaps of storage, um, UHF, so GME UHF there. Um, that all works, so as you can see there. Over the other side now, plenty of space in here. Um, I'll jump through these service books as well for you just so you can see um, looks like one private owner bought here in Cairns local and uh, yeah I'll just go through the service here if it'll ever pop up there we go um, there you go so we've had that couple of services there um, 13 and 19, we've just done the service here at Coral Motors, so that's us here. Um, now that is basically just two services have been done, obviously quite low case, so service history is all up to date, which is uh, always a good thing. Alrighty. I'll uh, let's have a bit more of a look through here, and I'll pop open the engine bay.
Alrighty. As you can see under here, massive engine um, in, the, in the front here, but uh, look, your battery's over the right hand side. Runs really, really nice and smoothly, as you can see. Massive air box and intake here. Got your brake fluid up the back here. Uh, coolant radiator side of things down the front here, as well as your uh, washer bottle fluid there top up too. So really, really nice. Um, but look, that's uh, pretty much going to conclude our little video on our uh, 2021 Ram. Thanks for watching, guys.